Hey guys, what's up? This is Dr. Chris Collier at Elite Chiropractic and Performance uh, in Chesterfield, Missouri. Uh, we're going to go over an exercise called the Nordic Hamstring Curl. It's one of the best exercises you can do for your hamstrings. It's awesome for uh, rehabbing a hamstring injury as well. So uh, it's involving an eccentric component, which is basically we're going to use the hamstrings to slow our body down. So whenever you can incorporate eccentric moves into a training program, whether it's rehab or you're trying to just you know, work out for strength or whatever, you're always gonna get better results in my opinion. So what it looks like is, so I'm gonna do the, I guess, uh, uh, individual version. You can do this with a partner. It's kind of like the Copenhagen adductor exercise. So basically, I am gonna have my feet pinned underneath of this bar here, like that. So if you had a partner, they would be behind you holding your feet down, okay? And sometimes that's actually better because your feet are closer to the ground where I'm still in a little bit of knee flexion here. So basically, all the same concepts as far as exercise, you know, we want good alignment, so I want my head in a good position, my ribs in a good position, and then building good core stability uh, via the diaphragm here. And what I'm doing is I'm allowing, I'm contracting my hamstrings, and I'm resisting this movement. So now I got my body weight and gravity, and I go and I go and I go and I go and I go, and then I can't go any further. So then I catch myself, and I push myself back up, and then we rinse and repeat. So this is, it's, it's harder than it looks, or if it really looks that hard when I'm doing it, I mean, it's challenging and you, real, you will definitely feel your hamstrings cooking on this one. And so as I go through this, you know, I might do sets of like five or six or something like that. So just try to find something where your, your legs can get um, kind of grounded a little bit, or you can have your partner hold on. So as I'm here, all the way down. Make sure though, as you're going down, that we're not starting to like arch our back or round it or our heads going forward or anything like that. Keeping everything in a good position. If you have pain when you do this, obviously don't do it then. Make sure that everything's uh, going on correctly in, in the body and whatnot. You might feel a little bit of lower back tightness, which is fairly normal. I think I did five or six there, and my, you know, I definitely feel my hamstrings going. So, um, an awesome exercise to include in a daily strength program. But also, if you pull the hamstring, you know, once or twice before, it could be that your your hamstrings aren't strong enough to slow your body down. Let's say you're running to first base in softball, and you you kind of plant that foot on the bag and you pull your hamstring. This is an awesome exercise for that. So, it's called the Nordic Hamstring Curl. Um, like I said, good for rehab, good for strength. If you got any questions, let me know. But awesome exercise. Please incorporate it into your routine, and uh, we'll see what kind of results you can get. Thank you.